everybody on island who knows Jojo. He'll go underneath you and he'll just kind of cruise with you. He'll look straight into your eyes. You can see his little bit of confusion in his face. He's looking over and seeing like, how are you doing this with me? He loves the surfing. He'll cruise right underneath the board. And then he'll go upside down. He'll sit then behind the rider and he'll jump up behind. He's just riding the wave like the surfer is riding the wave. And when we do the subway, you can cruise at this speed. And you're dolphin diving. He enjoys it so much, so what we'll do is we'll subwing for a bit and then we'll stop, just change over, and he'll sit and wait for the next two people to come in, and then he'll go again with them. But when we started the business, he just seemed to love coming up and interacting with us. You can tell Jojo, because he's 35, 40 now, you can see the age in his face. You can see the wrinkles around his eyes. The way he kind of acts around the boat, we'll be able to tell from that as to what he wants to do. Is you see them swimming in the water wanting to get in, and then he runs straight to the back of the boat and jumps in. They started playing in the water together. And then says, we'll try and dive down. Jojo definitely seems to really like playing with the dogs and that's why I think they get on so well when they're together because they just want to play. Oh, and luckily you can tell he's playing with, with the dog. Gucci is Jojo's kid. Bob is the mum of Scooter. We see them often. They love playing. There was talks actually of putting a dolphinarium here, which would have been horrible. There's a lot of car bump stickers that are around that say Jojo says no. And I think the general consensus was that we've been able to push the dolphinarium off. And it was largely because of how we have Jojo here and because of how they're free and wild here. They would be so against putting them in captivity. You can see them thinking and you can see them actually kind of processing things. They definitely do recognize some people under the water. They can see in between your mask and they can see the eyes. They've got personalities. They're more human-like than other animals. Yeah, get it, Bubbles! <laughs> hey guys, I'm Roman. I've got a really special story for you. 